Hey guys, it's Tara, and today I'm going to be reviewing some lip colors that I recently just purchased from Shea Moisture. I didn't buy them online, I actually purchased them at Ross. I got them all four of them in a pack together. I think I purchased it for about $10, maybe less. I could be wrong, I'll have to double check. So I threw away the, um, the receipt and everything. But yes, I'm going to show you guys the colors. I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to try them on for you so you can see what they look like on me. Right now I don't have anything on my lips. Nothing. So that way you can get a good idea of what they may look like if you want to get some for yourself. The first one, I'm going to read all the colors to you. Let's see. This one's a darker color, this first one. They come in this cute little package. They're individually packaged. This one is called Olivia. And the next one is a lighter brown. It's a brown tinted gold tone lipstick. It's not lipstick, I'm sorry, it's lip crayon. This one is called Christine. And this is what it looks like. The next one is a red, and I love red. I could wear red all day, every day for the rest of my life. This one is, this is what it looks like. And this one is called Kaylin, Keelan, K-E-Y-L-I-N. And the last one, because I only got four, this one is called Roberta, and it's a pink. I'm not super big on pinks, but I'll try it on just so you guys get an idea of what it looks like. So, yes. And I also, just to throw this in there, I purchased these super cute this five piece um, flawless face set brushes they're like little mini brushes and they're from eco tools I've used their stuff before and they're super cute this is what they look like and it tells you each brush what it's used for just in case you don't know because I never really know and they're super they're super cute compact brushes just to take on the go if you don't want to take your expensive brushes out of town or at a friend's house and you leave them there you don't feel so bad afterwards but yes Okay, so I'm gonna think I think I'm gonna go from lightest to darkest and I pulled out Roberta first. Yes. Now I'll try that on. Let's see. It's super light, which is not bad. It's super light, kind of like a gloss, let me see. Yeah, it's super light. This is what it looks like on skin. That's the Roberta. I don't think it's gonna get any darker than this. <laughs> Somebody's peeking in through the window at me, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is the darkest it's gonna get, which is not too bad because I really don't wear, I really don't wear pinks, and this is not too bad. It's pretty light. I don't know if you can see my arm, but yeah, that's this is the darkest it's gonna get, which is not bad. What I'm going to try is called Kel Ke Keelan. I can't get that name right, Keelan. I don't know where they found that name. It's the more red color. It's pretty much red. And let's see. They're all pretty light. They're not super thick lip, like lip crayons. This is what it's gonna look like. Let me see. Uh, I went way too far down with that one, but whatever, it's too late. It's way too late. It looks like I have so much on because I would put way, I think maybe I put it on wrong, but you get the gist of what the color looks like. It's very red. It's very nice. I like this. This is something I could wear every day. Not super heavy. Yeah. I think this is, this one is definitely a keeper. This is the one I want to keep forever. Let me see. Oh, sorry. 
try is going to be one of the gold brown tone colors. It's called Christine. This is what it looks like. It's the third color. It's a gold shade. I don't think it's going to look good on me, but I'll try it on for the sake of the video. But I do like the way they feel. These feel like kind of, they're not like slippery like a lipstick container, but they feel really good. And this bottom, I think, oh, it pushes the pencil up. Okay, so it kind of rotates the pencil up. Yeah. Okay, cool. So let me try on Christine and see. Um, ooh, that's so gold. It is so gold. Oh my god. Looks like something my grandmother would have worn in the 90s. Or something like Lil' Kim or Faith Evans would have worn. If anybody's trying to do like a Lil' Kim look from back in the day, this is it. This is definitely it. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I mean, maybe I'm putting too much on, but it's a pretty color for like if you're doing a costume or if you like gold tones or it looks good on you. Not on me, but I like the red. But I'm going to keep on going for the sake of the video. And not least, I have the Olivia crayon. It is the dark, like brown. It has a little bit of a shimmer to it, so I wouldn't call it exactly brown. The other one's more gold and bronze. This one's definitely brown. You may not even be able to see it when I put it on my arm because it's pretty much the same color as my skin. It's the last color right there. But you know what? I put it on my palm so you can see it because yeah, that's the color. It's almost like, when it goes into my skin, it's almost like the same color. So yeah, I'm going to try it on. But by the way, these go on very smoothly. There's no roughness at all. This is very smooth. I could just swipe this on and go any time of day, anywhere. I mean, it's not super dark to begin with, but not dark enough to be like, pal. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I think that's enough. I think that's it. <laughs> yeah, that's that's all I can put on. I don't think any more would fit or work well. And yeah, I, I mean, they're nice colors. My favorite though, hands down, of course, because I like red, would probably have to be this one. It's called the, um, what is this? Keelan. The one I can't remember. But I do like the pink. I'm not a big pink person, but this is doable. So the Roberta and the Keelan are definitely my top two pick. But if I was going to try a new look or like a costume or something fancy or something out of my comfort zone, I would definitely try the Olivia and this one, the Christine. So we'll see. But my pros would be, my pros would probably would be that they go on really smooth. I absolutely love how smooth they go on. They go on like a lip gloss. They're not as rough as a lipstick. Like I don't feel my lips pulling or moving when I put them on. And they're not as like hard like a lip pencil. They're really soft and really smooth. And I mean they don't have a taste or a smell. So I can't say they smell or they taste. Just a regular lipstick type, type of feel. And they're lightweight. I don't know how sturdy this cap is, like if you were to put it in your purse, it's it actually is pretty sturdy, you just have to push it all the way down. I would be nervous about leaving it in my bag floating around just in case it comes off. But so far I like all of them, I like all of these. This is the dark one, these are the colors again. And be feel free to email me or leave a comment about if you have any questions. I'm sure you could probably find these on their website. I didn't find them on the website. I got lucky and went to Ross and found them because I'm always bargain shopping. So I got a pretty pretty good deal. They were probably under $10 for all four of them together, which isn't that bad. But yeah, I definitely give it, I give these two, I definitely give these, uh, give it a thumbs up as far as, you know, it being smooth and feeling good. I have to wear it all day or for a few hours to see how long it lasts because I'm not sure if it would last if I had a drink or 
ate something. So we'll see what happens. I just want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. I think I don't think I have that much more stuff that I've been purchasing lately. I've been on a budget, but I have been doing some things. I may, I may come back to those. We'll see what happens. But thank you guys so much for watching.